there might not be a presidential election this year, but there are still some key local elections taking place this November. Now, all across Texoma, there are local elections happening as soon as just a few weeks away. Markeisha Jackson looked into what's coming up for us. So, Markeisha, what will voters be deciding on? Daryl, if you live in Wichita Falls, the election for a new mayor and new city councilors for districts 3, 4, and 5 are happening this November, while other places have elections happening as soon as May 6. The big one for Wichita Falls residents will again be the race for mayor. So far, the only two candidates are co-owner of Wichita Falls Coffee House, Frank and Joe's, Carol Murray, and Wichita Falls business owner and State Farm agent, Tim Short. Both candidates say they want your support and the chance to serve you. Their main focus, improving this city, hosting several meet and greet events so they can make those good connections. The mayor role is really vital because you represent the citizens and then you work with the city staff. So the mayor has to figure out what do the citizens need and then we have to comply with all of the laws and then we have to get things done. So our goal is to move past status quo and to grow the city of Wichita Falls. And the way that we do that is we take action. We pull the community together, we bring more businesses in, we add population by doing that, and we grow the city. The election for mayor will be on November 7th in other parts of Texoma. Burke Burnett, Holiday, Graham, Seymour, and Olney residents will be electing new council members. Wanakona and Petrolia decide on new school board members. Those elections will take place on May 6th. Now inside the story over on our website, you can find much more information on these upcoming elections and the candidates. Okay, Markeisha, thank you so much for that story.